Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of some GTA. I almost said uh, another episode of the real life series because I've been doing them so much. But no, today we're just checking out a, uh, a a map mod, good old map mod. So guys, if you do enjoy these, these map mods, let me know. Leave a like, leave a comment. Uh, make sure you let me know. If not, I, I'll just keep on doing the real life series, you know, and I won't do too many of these. But I kind of wanted to you know, do these on the side as well, on top of the uh, series and stuff that I have running on my channel. Today we're looking at a thing called the Flea Market, made by Salam Baker. Hopefully I said that right. Uh, and uh, yeah, we're just going to a flea market, which is interesting. Uh, don't know what's going to be in the flea market. I guess a lot of fleas. Got them. With, with, the, with, the, with the classic jokes, dude. Got him. Also, guys, I want to do a little shout out to my Twitch, guys. I've been streaming there a lot more over on the Twitch. A link is in the description. If you do enjoy these videos and you do enjoy my live streams, go over there. Make sure you follow me. Don't miss out on the streams. You know, there's GTA there. There's non-GTA stuff, but mainly non-GTA stuff. But I want you to be up to date. So link is, is in the description. Check it out. So anyway, here's the flea market here. And there's some people kind of spawning. What the hell is going on here? Uh, what the fuck? I just ran a dude over, I don't know why. I mean, this flea market location isn't very... Wait, I'm kind of... Illegal U-turns, let me just... Here we go, and... Uh, perfect. So this flea market is in a really awkward space here. Is this right across the freaking hobo camp? Or is it in the hobo camp? Uh, right. Well, anyway, we'll check... We'll, we'll take a look at this flea market. I mean, there's a bunch of valet parking here and stuff. I parked myself. Looks like they got some security here as well. Uh, they got some security here. Look at this. They got security. They got decent amounts of security. They even got SWAT police here. Interesting. And then all the way around here, it's kind of closed off. So the flea market is actually in there. So it's just like a your normal day market here. But why is it in the most nastiest place of the freaking map? And this guy's using his. What the hell? You see, that's like glitchy. I don't know why. That guy's like. So you're using it wrong. What? I I'm really confused why it's um. Why it's like this. Really weird, but I mean, look at this. It's in the hobo camp, are you kidding me? Why? It's like legitly in here in the hobo camp. I have no idea why. Uh, there's double tents here as well. It's all kind of very glitchy here. You can see that? There's two tents in there. They're changing color. Kind of weird. Uh, don't know why it's been so awkwardly different. Anyway, though, I, I guess let's have a look at the flea market here then. Before the game probably crashes or something. I, I, I'm not really sure why it's having so much weird issues here. Kind of strange. But here we go. Here's the flea market. So down here, this is like the main entrance maybe or something. I don't know if they're having like an auction here. Do you have auctions at a flea market? Are they like, you know, saying, trying to auction something off? Or this is this a TV production, TV live stream? Looks like they're doing some stuff there, which is pretty interesting. So let's have a look over here. So all these people are selling stuff here. There's just loads of money there just stand, just chilling outside. Like, yeah, that's normal. Sure. So these guys are selling ivory. Isn't that illegal? Can't, these guys could be arrested here. They're selling like ivory. It looks like a huge camera. Like, what the hell? Further on, we got... We, oh wait, those guys are from single player, and so are these guys. Wait, are all the... People selling from single player missions? Well, they're selling some ivory as well. Isn't that illegal? I don't know if it is. I mean, they're selling some actual gold as well, silver and stuff. Some just exploded somewhere. Nice. Selling some jukeboxes and stuff down here. We've got a couple of people selling driver licenses and passports. <laughs> How is this a thing? How is this not illegal? I'm so confused. Over here, it looks like this guy's selling electronics. I mean, that's pretty cool. He's selling TVs, PCs, cameras, uh, those, like, other camera things. I don't know what the difference is. Like, the really fancy cameras and just normal cameras. Headsets, books, phones, iPhones, new iPhone X, the Razer phone, dude, Magnaphones, the freaking next generation dialer phone. Over here, he's got mics. Speakers, backpacks, look at this. I mean, he's got tablets. This guy is very, 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 very good setup here. I mean, you probably buy one of these, you take it home, and it would, it, it probably has some like firmware on it, uh, where it, it kind of monitors what are you typing and probably hack all your stuff. So, you probably don't even want to use one of these buying it in a flea market. Over here, these guys are selling some food, as you can see, drinks, snacks, and stuff. So, this is like cafeteria type area. I like this so far, it's pretty decent. Shame that the guys don't really move or anything, they're not really 
doing anything. They're not moving. They're not having any fun here. Uh, we've got a couple of uh, entertainment kind of stuff set up here as well, like pool tables here, ping pong tables here. Uh, moving on here, we got. Is this <laughs> what kind of a flea market? <laughs> what flea market was gonna sell crystal meth and weed? I mean, this guy's like, yeah, uh, can, can, can I buy some of the good stuff, man? Can I buy some of the blue crystal, please? Like, what? How is this not shut down? I mean, they've got coke, crystal meth, weed. I don't know what that is. Probably some kind of, like, injection serum or something. Uh, like, w what the fuck? There's security here and SWAT here. That just doesn't really make any sense. There's Michael here as well, kind of chilling. He's probably going to be buying something here. That's really weird. I, I, I'm I kind of lost for words here. And you can... They even have washing machines here as well. So you can, like... Dryers. You, you can clean your clothes if you poop your pants. I, I, what kind of a flea market is this, guys? Am I missing out? Where is this flea market, guys? I guess this is the, this is how a flea market is done in GTA. Over here, look. Look what I saw over here. Franklin. Your boy Franklin with his, with his aunt here. Selling some jewelry. She's probably, like, made that jewelry herself or something, hasn't she? Yeah, saw some sunglasses here. Hats and stuff and shirts and driving license stuff. I guess pretty decent. Over here, these guys are trying to sell some astronology shit and legalized weed more weed tvs mm hmm very very nice here's to something a little bit more legal fruit stains these guys are selling some fruit makes sense i mean this might be the only honest business here that as far as i know they probably got like drugs in this watermelon right they probably got like phones and stolen cocaine pouches in the apples and watermelons it's, it's pretty messed up here but there's another fruit stand here as well down on this side, it's just food and stuff like that, so that's pretty decent. Uh, ATMs as well, you can take some money out, burgers and stuff, take away. This is pretty decent, I mean, I like this, this is believable. You can see there's tons of food things, people are ordering food. Talking about this food is making me hungry, my tum-tum's a little hungry. I'm like, man, I want some food, food, I hungry. I like it though, it's pretty believable, and there's like drinks machines on this side as well, so that's decent, and then over this side, we have a canteen, uh, where people can kind of sit, and, and they're, you guys are sitting wrong, what are you doing, <laughs> he fell on his ass, look at this guys, just sit, you're not doing it right, what the hell are these guys doing, you're not doing, you're not sitting right, look at that guy, I knocked him out, he's just passed out on the table there, take this guy out, what the hell, you guys are doing it wrong, you're not sitting, there you go, take these guys out, you guys are sitting wrong, this is, this is unacceptable. And this guy, take, take this guy out. Just give him the one punch, dude. Give him the one punch. That seems to... Like, ah, there you go. Knock him out. One punch and he's out, dude. See? Look at this. Franklin is strong as shit. Well, guys, that's kind of it. I don't know. I'm a little bit disappointed. I mean, I like... It's, it had an interesting start. Like, this... This stall... This person selling the stuff is the most interesting one. The rest of them are kind of, like, a bit mental. Like, I, I don't feel like... That's not a flea market. To cocaine and drugs like what and the location is pretty bonkers i mean there's probably better locations than that i mean you know have it on have it in sandy shore somewhere in an airfield or something like you know a flea market or an airfield there's a bunch of space in sandy shore somewhere else not in, around next to a hobo camp under the bridge i mean that kind of looks a bit weird i i i don't know it just it just doesn't it just doesn't seem right to me but i mean guys let me know what you think uh, did you guys enjoy it? Did you not enjoy this? Uh, if you did, make sure to leave a like. Click or share because if that's how much I grow. appreciate it on the support. So let's get rid of this and see what disappears. Here we go, boys and girls. One, two, three, and boom. There she goes. So all the, all the space has opened up here. It's just a weird location. I don't know how I feel about that. That whole situation was a little bit weird to me. Not really too sure about that. But guys, let me know what you think. I'll see you next video. Thank you for watching, thank you for joining, subscribe for more, and hopefully you guys are going to have a good day. I'll see you next time, guys. Let me know what you think. Bye.